Well, it's just racing slang, racing terminology, good thing. The good thing is home of Vernie King. And uh, well done to Brian and Owen. And we're going to talk a lot more about them in this interview just now. But the gentleman that uh, is uh, in the spotlight is Imzen Giese. He gets a thousand rand on behalf of Hollywood Bets and Gold Circle. Well done to you, Imzen Giese. Congratulations. Well done. Mark's here. Okay, well, let's talk to Keegan first then, Mark. My apologies. Everyone's wearing white shirts, so everyone looks the same. Uh, well done. And, uh, yeah, you, you did say to the punters and to the public that if this horse uh, uh, couldn't win today, he was going to battle. And as our race commentator, Craig Peters, upstairs said, he made heavy weather of it, but he won. That's the most important thing. Yeah, look, I always thought I was in a, in a, in a striking position and uh, in a winning position. And I pulled my stick a little bit earlier and I, I asked him to just go past Sean's horse because he's looking to get behind him. And he went past him and then he quickened past him and he wanted to stop with me again. So... He's just a horse. I know he's had a, f a couple of runs under his belt, but he's probably still learning. And I do probably think he's better off um, coming from a little bit more off them. But uh, from that draw, I had to take advantage of it. And uh, yeah, he won nicely today. You know, it's, it's a wonderful situation to be in because you're almost like a kid in a candy store when it comes to the rides. And uh, I hope you don't pay your agent too much because it must be, as I say, like picking candy off the shelves to get rides for you. And that's only a joke to Lloyd. Um, but, you know, you, you've ridden Gimme Gorgeous before. You've ridden, you know, this horse, Avernie King, you had to choose. And, and there's the, you know, the exactor that run first and second. And, of course, later on, maybe there'll be the exactor as well, the DeMello, you know, with that horse, uh, Al Ray Vien and, and MJ Udendal horse but uh, it was a good race and, and you obviously knew the horse in front and, and it's, it's worked in your favour. Yeah look it's, it's never nice jumping off other horses but uh, when it's a winning ride it's, it's worth it you know but yeah look uh, I didn't expect to ride this horse I was lucky enough that the owners wanted me on and uh, that's how I got the ride so just thank you very much to Mr Heffer and uh, obviously Makwa Barara well done to him as well thank you very much for the opportunity I think my last ride for them was uh, in a group to, in a group in a group one they're running second so yeah just thank you very much to them quite right lovely well done Keegan thank you very much just well done to Mark well done to Mr Musket thank you very much for the opportunities <laughs> obviously James is yet to represent Mr Heifer well, I can't wait to talk to James yeah let's see how that goes <laughs> <laughs> yeah no. but uh, yeah just well done to the whole team big team effort thanks very much to Tristan as well gave me a lot of insight on him I've obviously ridden him before but that was a while ago so thank you to him he does a lot of work behind the scenes thank you to the whole yard and uh, yeah to my sponsor winning form again thank you very much well done Squire thank you lovely come on another Squire not uh, good on the nerves you know it's it's everybody's banker well s s fancied well backed in the betting market and he, you know you're coming in with a horse that's been well tried but as keegan says if he didn't put his head in front today well then uh, maybe we would have been in trouble yeah you know there have been a, a few excuses in in previous runs but uh, he looked to get out of it again today <laughs> but uh, thankfully keegan you know got the maximum out of him when it mattered um, he does seem to prefer a little bit further and hopefully this win instills a little bit of confidence in him um, and teaches him a, a little bit more about uh, going to the front and staying there, not trying to duck it, uh, duck it out. But uh, just a huge congratulations to Mr. Makra Barara and Mr. Heffer. I know they've been very patient with this horse. Uh, it's taken a little bit of time, but um, thankfully we've got it right for them. So good luck to them, uh, to the boss, the team at home. Um, it's, it's always... Uh, it's always a lot of effort that goes into to every runner so very rewarding when when it comes through right and it's been a little bit quiet so nice to have a win on the board um just uh, good luck to the to the boss the team thank you to our sponsors hollywood bets and uh strength to strength is he back is he back mr musket or is he still gazing at the cape town mountain no i don't think he's doing any gazing uh, <laughs> he's got a very busy day on on saturday and then he's off to the sales and then um the, the horses will be returning home and then uh, we start prepping for the winter season. Lovely Mark, well done. Cheers, thank you. Thank you, cheers. We look forward to welcoming Peter Musket and all the KZN horses that have been down in the Cape to the province back home. And uh, well done, representing Owen and Brian Makubarara. I think uh, the friendship uh, between Owen and Brian, not many have experienced because it's, they've been together for a long time. No, they have and uh, they've stuck together and uh, just want to say well done to Owen, Brian, and uh, everyone involved, Mr. Musket, Mark, Daryl, Keegan for the ride. Very good win. Was this the best bet in the winning form publication? Uh, no, it wasn't. Did you at least tip it first? Yes, I did, yeah. <laughs> I'll let you off then. Well done, James, to you and the whole Hollywood team. All the very best. Thank you very much. Congratulations, James Rich. And uh, he's representing Owen and Brian. Well done, Owen, and to all of you at Hutz.
on the gorgeous uh, ridge of Amschlanga Rocks. I'm sure you'll be watching this uh, from Hollywood Bet Scottsville. And to you, Brian and Flo and your whole family, fond, fond memories of uh, walking around Zimbabwe with you, enjoying a wonderful holiday. So Owen and Brian, two gentlemen of the game, well done.